Hey guys, I just want to make this video as a quick rundown of a problem I came across. So I got a new um, router. I got the Nighthawk AC1900 by Netgear. And I hooked it up and it updated as I hooked whenever I first powered it on and connected it to the internet. And then it booted up and started, you know, running the internet like it should. But after about five to ten minutes, it would drop internet for like five to eight seconds at a time. And it would do this non-stop. So it did it like six times an hour or something like that. It was super annoying. And I started looking up trying to figure out how to fix it. And after literally probably an hour and a half, two hours of looking, I found this status, which needs to be number one. It's from 2014. But he had a R700, uh, R7000, and did the same thing. He plugged it up, it updated, and all that. But apparently, you need to do a hard reset on it. So, doing like he said, using a paper clip and pressing and holding the reset button for 30 seconds on the router. And then, while still holding the reset button, pull out the power cable for another 30 seconds and then put the power cable back in while still holding the reset button um, for 30 seconds. Um, then after you release the reset button, it says wait for the router to properly reboot. It won't actually do that, I don't think, because I waited like 10 minutes and mine was flashing a white light. So after 10 minutes, I just hit the power button on the router, turned it off, turned it back on, and waited for it to boot back up. Then I had to do like another small setup with the whole thing. And then down here, he's talking about um, who went to advanced setting and changed his WAN setup and changed the MTU to 1400. I checked mine and I was able to get by with 1472. And that seemed to fix my internet. I haven't had a problem. Let's see, I. Uh, my download's been consistent pretty much except for just now oh because it's updating so it's just writing right now but it stayed at like 9.3 megabytes a second the whole time um, if you need more information about the BTU go to this website I'll put it in the description and you can read up on it um, run uh, command prompt or whatever I like how it says LMS DOS prompt because it ain't been called that in forever but oh yeah this dude's running Windows Millennium Edition but this works just as good or the exact same on newer computers you just use command prompt instead of uh, LMS DOS prompt and you can keep subtracting the numbers until you find right where you want to be and you can punch that in but since I've changed mine it's probably been like three four hours now and I haven't dropped any internet it's been holding consistent the whole time oh after you change this of course you need to click apply and then it'll go through some kind of like little update period thing but I just hope it helps it saves you some time from looking all this crap up anyway thanks see you guys